Now, more than $10 million is on its way to Virginia Garcia Memorial Health Center, and that'll further boost the vaccine rollout there. Today, Oregon Congresswoman Suzanne Bonamici met with medical staff virtually to ask questions about any lingering concerns as the effort continues on. Staff there, well, they say they're focused heavily on underserved communities and one group in particular. As the pandemic um, landed very particularly hard on the Latinx community and on economically vulnerable families, um, we were really clear that what, when the vaccines were rolling out, that they needed to roll out in a way to address um, those families and the situation that they've been facing and struggling with for, for uh, since the start of the pandemic. Now, Virginia Garcia is allowed what's called the standard allocation of vaccine doses by both the state and federal government to meet their vaccination goals. Officials say they've reached their initial goal of 30,000 primary doses in Washington and Yamhill counties. That's also 5% of the population the health system serves. The